At ballparks throughout the majors today, there will be moments of remembrance and tribute to those lost to the events of 9-11. Their memories remain in our hearts as close as ever. We also remember the hard process of trying to return to normalcy following that tragic day, a challenge aided by the presence of our national pastime. Years ago, terrorist attacks on the United States changed our way of life forever. Today, our fellow citizens, our way of life, our very freedom came under attack in a series of deliberate and deadly terrorist acts. There was no precedent for such a tragedy on American soil. So Major League Baseball suspended all games indefinitely while our nation grieved and tried to make sense out of what had happened. Six days later, a familiar face appeared with words of encouragement. The President of the United States has said it is time to go back to work. And so, despite a heavy heart, baseball gets up out of the dirt, brushes itself off, and will follow his command, hoping in some small way to inspire the nation to do the same. And then another baseball legend confirmed that it was time to play. I don't know about you, but as for me, the question has already been answered. Should we be here? Yes. There was magic in the air. It is goosebumps at the Metrodome as baseball begins again. And when Mike Piazza stepped up to the plate during the first game back in New York, there were fireworks. Lopez wants it away. And it's hit deep to left center. Andrew Jones on the run. This one has a chance. Home run. Mike Piazza and the Mets lead three to two. And before game three of the World Series, the president gave us all something to cheer about. I was, uh, you know, loosening up and Derek Jeter came in. He said, hey, Mr. President, you going to be throwing from the mound or from the, you know, from the front of the mound? I said, what do you think, Derek? He said, throw from the mound. And please welcome the President of the United States. The energy and the crowd and the noise was really, really uh, powerful. The place went nuts. All of us just kind of looked at each other and like, that was pretty freaking cool. And I don't think I've ever seen uh, a country more unified than it was right then and there. Though our country suffered tremendously, let's remember how we all stood together to create an even stronger America. 9-11, never forget. <laughs>